Good afternoon, people of DriveWise Insurance. My name is Benny Bonds, and I'm here today to present a technical proposal for an innovative web application in which first time buyers can purchase their vehicle. To start with, the image display shows a mind map of the overview for the proposed digital solution. It shows the task required to be completed, the targeted audience, how the solution will be presented to you, and more. Next, we have the criteria that are to be met for the digital solution, including the prescribed criteria, self-determined criteria, and constraints. For the prescribed criteria, there is the personal, social, and economic impacts and considerations to identify risks, the user interface prototype, accuracy and efficiency of the algorithms, and a low fidelity, non coded prototype digital solution. For the self-determined criteria, the solution must appeal to the targeted audience using the CARP usability principles in the user interface design. Easy to navigate through the target audience, allows end users to find and purchase their first car, uh, display car specifications to end users and help them look for their preferred car, and must cater towards the target audience's preferences. Lastly, the development of this technical proposal was constrained due to the time limit time frame of six weeks, lack of motivation due to there being no reward for the effort put in, and other assignments needing my attention. Uh, little skill knowledge uh, of the important elements of developing a digital solution, such as UI designing and coding knowledge, and having temperamental hardware, making it difficult to complete most tasks. This technical proposal is being, being made for you guys, DriveWise drive Insurance. It must allow the target audience or end users to search for their first car. This will be done using easy to navigate menus with a search bar and filters. The cars being shown to the end user will be sourced from open, publicly available data sets. The technical proposal must also allow for contact to be made between the seller and the end user, um, allowing the end user to purchase their first vehicle. This can be done through the seller list and contact information within the post description, or as a separate box in the contact seller box um, when listing the vehicle. The targeted audience of this technical proposal are people who are looking to purchase their first car. Usually people uh, who are looking to purchase their first car are between the age of 16 and 21 years old. Usually have their P plates and don't have much money to put towards a car as they don't have a full-time job yet. The innovative digital solution will cater towards these people through having specialized filters for them. These will include a filter for L and P platers that will limit the engine size to a legal size for those respective plates and filters for the amount of money that the user wants to spend, as people around this age demographic don't usually have much of that. The proposed innovative digital solution will be developed for younger audiences, typically around the ages of 16 to 21, who are looking to purchase their first vehicle. The application will appeal to the targeted audience to be able to ensure interest from the audience, as this is done by using brighter colors, high contrast, and a game-like feel. According to the Golden Steps ABA, the average person will read only 20% of the words during their visit to the during their visit, and the average user will leave the page in just 10 to 20 seconds. To account for this, the proposed innovative digital solution will highlight only the most relevant data and will not initially show other data so that the user doesn't get overwhelmed with words and feel like leaving the application. Two of the given databases to base the innovative digital solution on are named automobile and car sales. The automobile database includes data such as the name of the car, miles per gallon, how many cylinders it has, the engine displacement, horsepower, weight, acceleration, and model year, and country of origin. The car sales database uh, includes the manufacturer, model, how many sales of the car there have been, the capacity, uh, few, sorry, the resale value, uh, vehicle type, price, engine size, horsepower, wheelbase, width, curb weight, and fuel capacity. The fuel efficiency, uh, and fuel efficiency, uh, and date listed. And the power to performance factor. Uh, these two databases have limitations, whether that be automobile, not having important information, such as the price of the cars. This will also, this would be due to the method that was used to gather the data from the internet. The digital solution uses these databases to retrieve Retrieve data when the user requests the data through viewing a car listing, or when scrolling through the listings, the data for the price, horsepower, and make and model possible SQL statements for this could be select price, comma, horsepower, comma, make model from automobile. 
This line could be used to retrieve the information to display the data for each vehicle on the listings page. When the seller first uploads the vehicle, they get assigned a new, unique ID, which is retrieved when the user clicks on that vehicle, allowing for more specific data to be pulled for that, just that one vehicle. Another possible SQL for this would be select asterisk from automobile where ID equals vehicle ID semicolon. Where vehicle ID is the ID of the vehicle that the end user clicks on. This will allow the users to view the data from the database in the application. Shown on the screen is a data table up the top to visualize the data in this database. Facebook Market, Gumtree, and car sales are all existing solutions for people looking to purchase that first car. Facebook Marketplace is a clean and simple to use user interface, which is why it is the most popular way of looking for cars. The proposed digital solution will take the inspiration from Facebook Marketplace's user interface when designing, when designing the page to be able to appeal to the target audience. In Facebook Marketplace, the only, only the essential information about the car is shown when scrolling through the listed cars. Uh, but when you click on the vehicle, you are able to see more detailed information about that specific car. Um, the aspect, uh, this aspect will be recreated in the Innovative Digital Solution in order to cater towards the short attention span of the target audience. The digital solution will effectively utilize the usability principles of existing solutions to improve upon and create a better, more intuitive user interface. These usability principles, such as uh, the contrast of each color listing against the background of the page, the clean alignment of the listings in columns, the repetition of other usability principles so that the user interface is easy and intuitive to use, and the proximity of important information. Uh, important information. These chosen existing solutions will also influence the innovative digital solution in terms of functionality in order to create an easier experience for first-time car purchasers. Functionality such as the ability to fill the car listings by different variables, being able to get in contact with the seller, and more are inspired by existing solutions, mainly Facebook Marketplace, Gumtree, and car sales. The sketches below show the user interface, or shown, show the user interface layout for the proposed innovative digital solution. The homepage on the left has the title of the application in a large, easy to read font that contrasts the background nicely. The colors orange and gray were chosen to be the primary and secondary colors of this application because they complement each other while also allowing high contrast between important information and just the background color. Between the title is the search bar, or sorry, just below the title is the search bar, an easy predictable uh, location with the universal icon for searching the magnifying glass. The home page is split into three main areas for the buttons. Um, the home page Sorry. The home page is split into three main areas for the buttons. Listings up the top, so that the user can easily get straight to the main content of the application. Information in the middle, in case the user is unsure on how to use the application or how to purchase a vehicle, as it's their first time purchasing. Um, and finally at the bottom, the quick button. Uh, this allows the, so that the user has easy access to close the application for safety reasons. These buttons are colored as a traffic light to keep a light heart of the experience. With the listings as, as green, as is the main feature of the application, the information is yellow and the quick button is red, as it is commonly used for, as a commonly, commonly used color for quitting or stopping. On the other pages of the application, the title, filters bar, and search bar all remain in the exact same place at the, as the, all remain in the exact same place at the top of the page. This is to keep repetition between the pages and making the UI easier to learn. The listings page has the listings neatly ordered in a list underneath the header, showing only the important information and keeping each listing relatively small so the user can scroll through more listings. When the user clicks on any of the listings on the listing page, it will expand to the expanded listings page, the first box shown, um, which enlarges the picture, gives more information to the user and adds a contact seller button so that the user can easily go further in the purchasing process. Shown are the algorithms for the filter feature and the navigation of the pages in pseudocode. The first algorithm takes screen presses, mouse clicks and keyboard strokes as inputs. Using these to detect when the filter buttons are pressed and allowing the user to type in their preferences. The algorithm then outputs the different listings that are adjusted to the user's preferences. 
the second algorithm takes mouse clicks uh, and screen, screen presses as inputs to detect when the user presses the different buttons in order to output the different screens to display. On the screen now is an evaluation of the proposed digital solution that has been made and the recommendations and how to improve upon the criterion. The criterion being the, the criterion being the predetermined criteria, self-determined criteria, and the constraints.